welcome back to NRM 638, Python Scripting for ArcGIS Applications, Spring Semester 2015. This is an e-learning class at the University of Alaska Fairbanks. This week we're going to work with Python toolboxes. And Python toolboxes are very similar to our script tool toolboxes. The difference is with a script tool, if we look at the properties, the script file is stored in a different location. With a Python toolbox, if we edit it, everything is one giant Python script. And there are basically classes. So for example, a class toolbox, a class tool, and then within this class tool, we have, we can create parameters. We can check whether a license is required. We can interact among parameters, etc. So the big difference is a Python toolbox is one PYT file, but the behavior will be very similar to our custom toolbox. So for example, if we execute this custom tool, it has dialogues, it has parameters, we can have help, etc. The same thing with our Python toolbox. So for example, if we execute this tool, it has parameter dialogues, it has help, etc. Both the custom toolbox and the Python toolbox, we can interact among parameters. So I'll teach you how to do that this week. So for example, this parameter is disabled until the user picks a choice. So for example, the user chooses geographic and then the second dialog becomes enabled and then it's populated with a value list of appropriate choices for geographic. Or if the user selects projected, then that's no longer a correct choice so now we have a list of the correct choices. Okay, so for this week, your assignment will be a fairly simple assignment. It's to write a Python toolbox. So that's going to be a PYT file that has one tool. So if we execute this tool, the output polygon feature class is disabled. And we have this help dialog which has first use folder icon to browse to a folder containing your text file so we'll browse to a folder containing our text file so we'll grab the shoreline points that we used in week four and then as soon as we add that as our input text file and we have also a prompt saying select your text file and then add. So then we have internal validation that it checks that is this really a text file. And then next go to the next dialog to enter your output feature class. So then we would output go to this dialog browse to a container a folder or a geodatabase to contain your output polygon. So I'll browse to some folder connection and I'll just call this test polygon and save. And then we could execute our script tool. So then this Python toolbox tool will create a polygon from our text file. So then OK. And our script tool executes and creates our polygon feature class. So what we're going to do this week is if you go to any folder and right mouse click and go new, you can create a new custom toolbox is what we did in the previous two weeks. This week, we're going to go new Python toolbox. And that will be a PYT file. And then if you right mouse click, you can edit it. And that will be everything is within this one PYT Python script. Okay, so if you go to the Blackboard website, the first video session, will be on classes because basically we're going to be working with classes like the class toolbox and the class tool. 
So the first step is you need to understand about classes, objects that are created using classes, and then object properties and object methods.